Welcome back everybody, my name is Philip, and it is getting incredibly sunny out there. I'm gonna have to get out there soon. Anyway, today we have another start to finish editing tutorial using Aurora HDR 2019 to take this night image that I took in Japan and Tokyo recently and transform it to that photo right here. In hopefully extremely little time. So let's go and check it out. After the intro. Alrighty, here I have my three different exposures, the minus two, the zero and the plus two. Now if you have never heard of HDR photography, I suggest to check out this video and the associated guide with it. It's going to tell you anything and everything that you need to get started. Now let's grab these three exposures and drag and drop them into Aurora HDR. Once in here, I'm going to hit auto align because I was handheld and also because people are moving, I'm going to hit the ghost reduction. Let's go for it. And here we are. So if we compare this already to our original, I do like that much more evenly lit, but we can spice it ever so slightly more. First thing, I'm going to go to the lens here, to the lens correction, and here I'm going to actually add some fisheye effect. And that's simply to make the street a bit more prominent. Something like that. I like it. Cool. Done. Next, I want to crop it down a little bit. So I'm going to crop it to something like uh, maybe something like that. Or maybe not quite as low. Maybe something like that. Hit the Enter key and let's apply that crop. And once we are done, I'm going to use a preset to get me a certain part of the way because I am lazy and why would I have to do everything manually? Now, before I apply it, I'm going to create a new adjustment layer. And here I'm going to apply the preset or the look better sunrise. Now that really boosts the colors a bit more. So the last things I want to do is I want to bring up the highlights again a little bit more to something like that. And maybe add a little bit of smart tone just ever so slightly to bring really all the darks out of here. Now to really draw the eye into the center of the image. Last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add a vignette. So I'm going to go and use that nice slider here too. Maybe something like uh, this we could possibly do. And we can also increase the inner brightness just a notch, just ever so slightly. Awesome, let's go close, close everything we don't need. And we have the before and the after and the before and the after. Now, of course, you can add more contrast or whatever you see fit. But for me, I'm very happy with this nice picture of super busy Tokyo. And there we go, super quick edits. Now, uh, thank you for watching. And if you did like the video, do not forget to hit the thumbs up button. And also, if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. It's going to help me out a lot. Other than that, I'm out of here for today. And I shall see you next time. Have a good one. Bye.